Hi, I'm Brenda Meyer, the author of The Little Red Fort, which I'm excited to talk to you about for World Read Aloud Day. My favorite read aloud memory is actually of being a parent, of sitting on the sofa with my kids piled around me, sharing, sharing stories, talking about the characters, discovering new words, learning about the wider world around us, and, and especially those happy endings um, with these little guys. At some point, everyone's going to have to read something in front of an audience, whether it's a report to the class or a, you know, a poem that you've, you're reading, just something. And so it's important for all of us to read aloud because then you're gonna have that confidence. You won't be nervous when you do have to speak up in front of people. The Little Red Foot, Ruby's mind was always full of ideas. One day, she found some old boards. Who wants to help me build something? She asked her brothers. Not me, said Oscar Lee. I don't think so, said Rodrigo. No way, said Jose. I'm too busy. Who wants to help me clean this plate? Ruby asked. We do. The boy said, Ruby's foot. Oh, I don't think I've ever heard a children read my story. <laughs> if you want to continue the fun for World Read Aloud Day, you are welcome to go to scholastic.com for a free teaching activity guide for the Little Red Fort. And um, it's got some fort building ideas, or if you want to build your own fort, go ahead and do that. Put a, post a picture and you can tag Scholastic and World Read Aloud Day and Rad Challenge. I'd love to see those if you can tag me on there too. <laughs>